hello guys welcome back to the ctx cloud this is the video number six in our net scalar training series today we are going to discuss in how many ways you can deploy your net scalar so generally we will place our net scalar in dmz zone so what is exactly dmz zone so the zone between your internal and external firewall is called as dmz zone so generally we will place the things inside dmz zone where we want to expose these things in outside internet so let's say if we have an exchange server we have an any sharepoint or any website which we want that public can see our website or our data so that is uh, that's what we are we will expose over the internet so that and we will place those servers in dmz zone so if we want to do the load balancing of those those servers like uh, those servers so how we can do that so we can do the load balancing of those servers with the help of netscaler so the client will request to the firewall then we will net an ip over the netscaler and then it will communicate to the backend server and vice versa it will send this traffic to the firewall and then firewall will send this traffic to the public ip so in that way we will configure the net scaler in dmz zone but we have another another scenario say we want we have some attendance servers like we have some servers who are used by the users internally so they are not going we are not going to expose these websites outside the internet like we have some databases we have uh, some attendance system which we do not want that this will go outside our internet and outside the internet users can access this so and like we have the citrix storefront which we do not want to expose over the internet citrix gateway we will generally configure in dmc zone but the internal websites we do not expose over the internet so in that scenario we need to uh, place this net scaler here i mean inside lan network so let me create a new diagram for you in this diagram you guys can see that i have placed the net scaler inside this lan network so my internal users are going to query with the net scaler and then net scaler will check the load balance servers inside our lan network and then it is going to respond only the users who are inside our lan network not outside so these are two ways where we can configure the net scaler so the first way where we are going to configure the uh, our citrix net scaler in dmz zone that's the pre preferred met, uh, method so generally we will do that method but in some scenarios where users i mean company want that we can load balance our internal servers as well with this net scaler so we can place the net scaler in lan network as well so thank you guys this is the end of this video in, uh, in our next video we are going to do the practical of these things thank you thank you guys